Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of weeks, I've been posting quite a lot about Microsoft Photos because it was recently updated with the new Windows App SDK. But as I mentioned, it took quite a long time to open. And then I posted a couple of days later that uh, the Microsoft Photos is opening a lot faster again. And then a day or so later, I posted that if your device had been updated to the Microsoft Photos app from the Windows Store after June the 4th of this year, 2024, you might face issues starting the application. And that was a known issue that was confirmed by Microsoft that the Photos app might fail to start. Now it seems that Microsoft is trying to somehow fix this issue regarding the app failing to start and for a lot of users taking quite a good couple of seconds to actually launch and open up when you launch the Photos app on um, Windows. And there's a change in the Canary channel of Windows 11 where Microsoft uh, has rolled out a new version of the Photos app which has been spotted once again by Phantom of Earth over on X. And if we head over to a screenshot provided um, regarding that um, change, here we can see there is a new performance toggle in the settings of Photos, which is an option that lets your system um, run the Photos app in the background at startup to improve performance. So obviously, this is a very similar feature we get in Microsoft Edge uh, called Startup Boost, obviously. And now Microsoft trying to do the same with uh, Photos, where if this is toggled on, allow photos to run in the background at startup to improve performance. It should then, obviously, because it's constantly running in the background at startup, although it's not open, you will have processes regarding photos running. So when you click on the actual app to, to launch and open it, it should open a lot faster. Now I'm going to say but here. Now the reason I'm saying but is because although photos might launch faster, obviously now this is going to be an app that's going to run on startup uh, when you launch Windows, which means that although Photos might start faster, Windows might start a little bit slower, especially if you are, are on a more low-budget, lower-end device with not a lot of um, you know fancy hardware and so on. So it's kind of like tongue-in-cheek. Um, it most probably will help the app open faster, but to some extent or the other, it could bring a bit of negative... Um, and a bit of a negative when it comes to the startup time of Windows, especially especially on a low-budget machine. And just to put this setting all into context, if we head into our settings, uh, this is where the setting will appear if and when it does roll out to the stable version. I don't see why it wouldn't roll out, but nonetheless, this is where you'll see performance allowing that Photos app to start uh, in the background. And obviously, I'll keep a close eye on this one. And if anything changes, I'll keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.